a milestone today in the construction of a new $2.7 billion terminal at Newark Airport. Today, workers installed the giant exterior steel beam on Terminal 1. It will be 20% bigger than the Terminal A it will replace and promises to have all the modern travel conveniences. Here's New Jersey reporter Anthony Johnson. What a difference a year makes. This steel beam signed by the governor, Port Authority officials, and political leaders is the final piece of iron used to complete phase one of the new Terminal A. The governor says the project is important to the state because many businesses interested in coming to Jersey want to see a state-of-the-art airport when they arrive at Newark Liberty. So this is a really good day for Newark Liberty. It's a great day for the Port Authority, and it's an extraordinarily good day for the great state of New Jersey. The new terminal project officially got off the ground last October 15th, and in just a little over a year, the iron skeleton, which resembles a spaceport from Star Wars, is complete. Both sides are working very well together, and, it, and that's what's important when we're not competing with each other, but we're cooperating with each other. The work now moves into phase two as the $2.7 billion project makes its way closer to completion. It will replace Terminal A, which is much smaller and looks and feels old. Once the new terminal is finished, travelers will see more amenities, more restrooms, more restaurants and stores. The Port Authority says the topping off ceremony proves its commitment to making the region a 21st century transportation leader. We are committed to getting this project done on time and on budget, and it is only the beginning. The new Terminal 1 will be partially opening in 2021 and will be fully operational in 2022.